What is up guys? Chaos Kicks coming to you with a brand new sneaker pickup video number 45. So we're pretty close to 50 sneaker pickup videos. So uh, hopefully we get to that soon. And probably by the end of this month. Hopefully. I am not guaranteeing you anything. But anyways, we got three pickups in this video. Two are for my personal collection and then the other one is just something that I got up for sale. So let's get into it. So starting with the less important shoe, the one that I got up for sale, obviously it's less important because it's not in my collection, but just to uh, throw it in here, we got the LeBron 12 Easter. These are size 11 and a half, brand new dead stock. Um, these are going to be for sale. Don't know on a price yet. These might have already been sold possibly depending if my friend wants them still, but I'm not sure yet. But if not, they will be up on the website. They actually are up on the website right now. But I don't, the price is kind of just random. I think I have like $100. So I don't know if I'm going to keep it at that price or not. I might lower it a little bit. But LeBron 12 Easters. Actually, it's a pretty decent shoe. I like the pattern on the uh, on the posit right here. It's very nice, actually. A very nice touch to the shoe. But I probably wouldn't wear this colorway just because it's the purple and the orangish salmon type laces. I just really don't like that. But just... It just flows, like the color scheme goes well together, so that's what makes it a, a good shoe, but I don't know. Next up is one of my personal collection shoes, and it's actually really, really, really nice. Um, I got this for on-court purposes, but I really am tempted to wear it off-court. I don't know yet. It's not the best performing shoe. Uh, I thought it'd be better, but it's still not bad compared to some other shoes that I've worn in past times. So it is the LeBron 14, and it's this BHM colorway. Um, very, very nice, though. I love the black gold it's just a, the perfect amount of gold that just pops out the shoe and obviously you're just normal black and white and um, I just noticed that there's like some leather right here I didn't even notice that until this very moment right now so I okay I guess that works probably just to add some uh, support towards your toes whatever um, but just this colorway is very very nice this black and gold is is awesome the laces are absolutely amazing the strap it, it just with the black and gold is in, and very very nice you got your uh, clear out sole as you can tell I wore these a couple times indoors um, probably about like three or four times so um, that's how I know how they feel I'm going to be giving you a performance review on these within the next day or two I'm actually going to be recording it right after this video so I'll be having the same shirt on and everything but uh, not a bad shoe though uh, definitely worth the 175 uh, just for the style of the shoe it's really nice and like I said it's not a terrible performer um, if we were going just off of performance for prices I'd get these probably about like $120 but just because they look so nice they're definitely worth the 175 and on to the third and final pickup of this video and it happens to be my favorite pickup um, it's a shoe that didn't too, do too well on the shelves uh, did worse than I thought it would but probably because of the price tag and that's what affected it but it's still a very very nice shoe and it's the beautiful Jordan 6 All-Stars um, I really really like this shoe uh, I think like I said the problem was 225 and nobody's gonna pay that for a non OG colorway so that's what made these not sell out and there's a story like a weird thing on these uh, not a story but something I experienced so I woke up late and I thought these were gonna sell out real quick so I woke up late and I was like oh damn it you know I'm not gonna get them so I went on there and it said sold out I'm like, ah, screw it, now I can't get them. So I just, I was, I was so mad. So I just kept refreshing the page, hopefully that, that they were gonna, um, hopefully they were gonna come back. And the reason I'm doing this is because I'm, I was on my phone, so this is my version of, of swiping, whatever. Besides the point. So about 10 minutes later, uh, they came up and they had a full size run again. So I'm not sure if they actually did sell out. Obviously they didn't. If Nike had a full size, you know, run back in stock, so it's not like they can make them that quick. So I don't know how that happened or what it meant but they still got them and they still got every single size on the website still so obviously that means they didn't sell out um they have these at like Foot Locker finish line everywhere so these aren't crazy at all but I just really like the shoe in general just the, the color tone and like I said the iridescent to the top and the outsole is just really really nice uh it gives the hints of green which really uh makes the shoe just look nice and pops out and some I didn't notice until after I wore these because uh, I did wear them one time. It's just the lace tips that are green and blue, if you could see that. And that's also a very nice feature to the shoe. Uh, the shoe is definitely worth 190 but the fact that they priced it at 225 is probably what made it not sell. But it's just something new, and you don't see this on any other Jordans. At least to my knowledge, it didn't happen on any Jordans. Uh, so this, the ones and the 31s, obviously, that all released that same All-Star Week slash weekend. But overall, uh, very, very nice shoe. Definitely worth the cop in my opinion uh just for looks wise maybe 
not for 225 if you're you know that og head but whatever i liked it and i thought it, it was definitely worth it so that's why i grabbed it okay so those are the three pickups of this video the lebron 14s the lebron 12s and the jordan 6 all-stars so definitely worth the cops on my opinion i got the lebron 12s for a steal and the other two are just for my personal collection and i like those two a lot so uh very very good shoes just i mean prices could have been different but whatever i just bought them because i like them and i guess that's what matters in the long run so uh i don't know if you can hear my brother he's he's whack but uh anyways though thank you guys for watching i hope you like these three pickups that i got make sure you drop a like and subscribe comment on what you think of these pickups and if you think i should have paid full retail price for them uh you guys are probably gonna say no you definitely shouldn't have uh the lebrons i think those are sold out the bhm so I guess those aren't bad for retail, but uh, like I said, if you're paying straight up for performance basketball wise, it probably aren't worth the 175. You can get something way better. Um, but I just bought them just because I really, really like them and that colorway, uh, which is a very, very nice colorway with that gold and black. So whatever. Besides the point, uh, this is Chaos Kicks. Like I said, do all that stuff. Like, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching. We are out.